mkale njin tunasema coin ni mwizi na metals kwa matako Sindi akililia chakula akienda kwa matanga akose chakula tusemi Sindi mjaluo tunasema Sindi Henry Budoi akikuja hapa kulala kwa wheelchair anadanganya ni mgonjwa anakaa kwa wheelchair mchana usiku anaenda kwa gym tunamkola out as Henry Budoi atusemi ni waluya wote Mirabel akitusi wazazi wake atusemi Mirabel ni mkikuyu tunamkola out as Mirabel Gidaiga akikuja kudanganya hapa ati ameibiwa na akaekewa mchele na hakuna police report hakuna anything there is no record anywhere hatumuiti wa kikuyu ama watu wagema tunasema Gidaiga Wini akikuja hapa kutudanganya ametembea mpaka India na nini na nini na nini tuna deal na ye kama wini Hakuna mtu alileta tribe ya wini hapa tulideal na ye kama wini Roy akidanganya amebakwa mpaka akajipaka mafuta ya neli ya samaki aliamka usiku akaenda akajiingiza kwa karaya ya neli akajisoka huko akajipaka na mafuta Hakuna mtu alisema wajaluo wamebakwa. Tulisema sisi Roy alisema amebakwa and we called him out for that as Roy. We call you by your name. Your tribe has nothing to do with your character. We call you by your name. Hmm? It has nothing to do with where you come from. Zero at all. Nothing at all. But you you wake up in the morning and you decide to bundle people in a basket. And one thing you don't understand is that when you do that there are people on your platform that actually buy that garbage and then tomorrow you are going to see people being hateful You know we got to call out tribalism when we see it and the reason why I'm calling you out Polina is because I have seen it several times and I've been mentioned the times I've seen it The first time was with Raf Muli, the second time was this issue of Murima and now the third time was today. Wale ma pastors wa Kikuyu walikuwa wanaenda kulala na wanawake na chai yao ikaletwa hapa. Tukichekelea hiyo chai yao, hatukuwa tunachekelea wa Kikuyu, tulikuwa tunawachekelea siji wa Mujomba, siji wa Munani. Tulikuwa tunawachekelea na majina yao. Tulikuwa tunawachekelea na majina yao. Hatukuwa tuna ati tunaongele. Hata sisi tulikuwa tunafuata hiyo chai na hiyo chai ilikuwa in Kikuyu language. Ama nadanganya guys. Hiyo chai ilikuwa ime iko recorded kwa recording kwa waji kwa, 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 imeandikwa nini vitu mingi zilikuwa kwa Kikuyu na mimi sielewi Kikuyu. But bado nilifuata hiyo chai na nilikuwa na pa, naenda pale kwa Suga Chambi na translate hiyo chai nilikuwa pale yani nilikuwa loyal. Nilikuwa loyal juu nilikuwa nafuatilia hiyo chai. Unaona? Juu mimi nilikuwa naona individuals, si kwa naona tribe. There's nobody that has ever thrived by being divisive, Polina. Nobody has ever thrived by being divisive. Nobody has ever grown by creating acrimony and animosity. You are sowing seeds of discord on this platform and you need to be called out. 
you are sowing seeds of discord you are sowing seeds of hate in this platform and you need to be called out and that is why i'm calling you out and i'm not gonna lie to you i really don't care what you do i don't care i'm calling you out because some of us understand very well what the so the seeds of discord can do and what the seeds of discord is capable of doing now that our country is in turmoil right now kenya is in turmoil we just impeached a deputy president we had another one installed there is acrimony in the country so you need to be very careful with the things that you say be very careful with what you say on your platform when kenyans are angry for change and kenyans are angry with the status quo and kenyans have just impeached a deputy president because of the same tribalism you need to be very careful about what you say on your platform and you need to be responsible for what you say on your platform it's important that you do so haya nimemaliza hiyo address ninataka kuenda pale 